Oh, you forgot to put it towards me. Of course. I was going to say, there's an empty comment. Here's 200 bucks. I, I like to think that what happens is I'm sitting here, right? And then Valerian just walks by and just drops some money on me and then just keeps walking. Like, yep, I'm out. It's like, what? Okay. Thank you. And he's already gone. He's already gone. Wait a minute. Blacksmiths make things using their hands! We need to ban blacksmiths, guys. And everyone with hands. Oh my gosh. That's a keep to defend. Look at that. Alright, we just have to assault that wall. Or, well, that cliff. Hang on. We have to get through those trees. Then go up that cliff. Then go up that wall. And then we'll be able to attack the actual base. We got this, guys! Let's go! Can we just do flying stuff? Sure. Sure. Well, I guess. I want to do it the easy way. Let's get to work. We are not guards, soldier. We are men. And until we know our place again, Aeonir will not return. Okay. Um... Oh, my, my giant greatsword just slipped right into your throat. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I actually have a heal spell, but I, I, I am a mere man. I should not use this to, to mend this wound. It is as it should be. Amaste. Why would you want to dodge candy? Oh, if it's a Mars bar. That makes sense. Or worse, good and plenty. Ooh. Yeah, just black licorice bullets. There you are. Ready? Are you? Are you Gilbert? W what? Well, w are you Gilbert? Are you Gil? Are you Gil? Are, are you Gil? Are you? Are you Gilbert? W what? Well, we were sent here by Mother Kalia from the refugee camp in the south. It's because they're French. Damn it! Those freaking Frenchies. <laughs> How dare they be better than us in every way? Wait a minute. And if we help you, does that mean we'll be spared? Will you get us out of here? It won't be easy, but yes. I will. Great, I can't wait to work for the mass murdering genocidal jackass. Hang on, Vigilant has just told me that he has found the light. Oh my goodness! <laughs> yes, yes, Vigilant, I agree. We should kill all the mages and then all the... I don't know, I'm trying to come up with something. Yeah. All the people with red hair, and then all the people with brown hair, and then all the people with no hair, and then all the people with skin. Thank you, friend. I... They would have taken me to the gallows tomorrow. Just don't make too much noise, will you? That was his cell? With the corpse hanging in there and the cobwebs literally covering the wall? Oh my god. I notice semi-frequently. Have you lost your bloody mind? What? Because I'm not a goddamn sissy? No way on earth I'm letting these bastards get away with this. These were just normal guards, not the people who tortured you. All the same. If you want to run amok, go ahead. But you're not dragging us into this. <laughs> Heck do I care. Probably for the best. Enjoy your death, dick. Rule zero, buddy. Sorry. Yeah, his name is Dick, for God's sakes. Uh, okay. I mean, yeah, it's kind of... Yeah, Vigilant. It's just... Because sometimes you can rebuild something, sometimes you can make something better, repair it, and restore it, and sometimes you need to just kind of go... and make something new in its place. And I mean that kind of literally in this case. This this whole keep is going to be uh, sea level when I'm done with it. Oh, for fuck's sake, this place will be burned to the ground if you don't let me help you. Are you ignorant or just plain stupid? All right, that's it! No one talks to me like that. No one! Uh, but, but shut it! I'm done with this! You want to leave my men to their deaths? Fine! Do it! Let this whole fucking place go to the claws of Nor! I don't give a damn anymore! Well, shit. Clara won't be happy about this. Commander Mart has left your party after being in your party for approximately five seconds. Yes, you still have to fight them and possibly die. But I didn't want to die. Listen. If you didn't want to die, you probably shouldn't have joined the army. You conscripted me! That's right. Because you are great and awesome. Yes? 
Let's see. Yeah, we hate magic in this setting. Now let's use this magical portal to head back to town. Okay. Yes. Who is this? Hmm. Good flesh, but not best. We'll feed power, but not for long. God King thanks. You're welcome. I guess. Yeah, exactly, von Falkenstein. I don't think Act of Blizzard would do that. See if they also have a shard in them. Because, I mean, Act of Blizzard, you know. And, and I don't even mean that as a necessarily negative thing, even though I totally do. It's just that Act of Blizzard will go with what sells, and RTS games do not sell as well as the other things they're making. That's all there is to that. Just look at what they've been not doing with StarCraft 2 for years at this point. It's wasteful, if I could just be blunt for a second. Wasteful, pointless, and stupid, but whatever. Exactly, Valerian. There's nothing wrong with a company wanting to make money. I want to make money. Money's useful. I bet every single person in chat wants to make money too. But that's not what companies do. Companies instead are like, Sean, who just gave me five dollars, and he's like, I'll give you this five dollars if you will destroy your business and society as a whole by breaking down the very fabric of creative construct for the sole purpose of making slightly more money now and guaranteeing lesser money later. And I'm like, Sean, Sean, dude. And Sean's like, okay, okay, just put it towards Mass Effect. I'm like, thank you. Thank you, Sean, for putting it towards Mass Effect instead of the destruction of society. Appreciate it. Right, I wasn't live this morning. Hey guys, I wasn't live this morning. I haven't been streaming for the last uh, nine hours. Huh. That's a really weird thing to find out. Is this a dream? Am I still asleep? Is this still Friday? That wouldn't even surprise me at this point. Dude. I am exaggerating slightly for effect, it's just I really don't see how... God dang it. Ugh. How Lord of the Rings could even put up a fight. Like, imagine if the entirety of Lord of the Rings' setting just suddenly invaded Azeroth right now. That would be a subplot of an expansion. You know, they, like, oh my god, who are these new people who are attacking us? They have giant dragon creatures, and, oh, I mean, we fought dragons before. But they also have, you know, angels and, and the, the, the trolls. Oh my god. And then Warcraft wins. <laughs> hey, I got a traitor. The orcs claim part of the Protoss city. No, really, that's what we're looking at. Again. Some years ago, there was talk of an Ash Reaver shifter who had attempted to morph into a troll. He succeeded, but his heart, uh, the troll's heart, stopped before he could take a single step. So you see why most shifters aren't that eager to experiment. Huh, well, that's definitely interesting. Thanks for taking the time to explain. Sure. I'll be off. Cool, cool, depressing, cool. Uh, now that I have that little bit of nightmare fuel, I'm going to go scream forever. So they just have a torture chair out here. In, in the woods, for some reason. These are nice folk, I, I can tell. It's okay. If, if TIE Fighter taught me anything, it's that we need more <laughs> escort missions in our life. I was actually about to say, you know, it's ridiculous how they're like, For Norten! Like, imagine someone charging into battle against unarmed civilians, screaming, For whatever! You know? For the queen! For the queen! We will murder these people! Burn them. Death to the innocent! You know, it's... Well, still. No entry. This is an outpost for the Royal Army. All right. Tiara light your path, soldier. I doubt she will, but... Thanks. And there's the light. Namaste. Just give the word. And he's dead. 
All right, so now that he's dead. I'm telling you that your son can enter if he enlists with the military and that you have to wait. Wait. Yes, right. Wait until that sodding bloodburn, the rebels, or the queen lovers have wiped our camp out. Next in line, please. Pfft. Scum. That's what you are. Next in line. Okay. That's that sounds promising right there. Like you see that, right? It's it, I'm like, okay, focus the camera on my units and it's putting me way up here instead of down here where my units are. That is really strange. Whatever. That is super buggy. But not as buggy as Inoceans. Nothing out bugs the Inoceans. Nothing. Yeah, I'm getting that vibe too, Mr. Red. Like I said, I really feel like he is just being... Like, this is just personal for him. But he's just like, yeah, you know. I mean, I could take care of the country and the crown and my loyalty, but but that guy, he hurt my feelings, so he needs to die. Did you just requisition an entire company to go after one man because of a personal vendetta? Yes. Okay, just making sure. Here's all your troops. Damn it. I need healing. Come on, don't die on us now. They killed one of our heroes. Wow, this random bandit group is absolutely shredding me. And we're dead. <laughs> wow! Of the few refugees who <laughs> the Just shredded me. These enchanted eyes, her hair golden and sweet like molten honey, her shapely cheeks with a touch of rose like a blossoming flower, her slender waist like... Yeah, I get it. Thanks. So, do you think she's smitten back? Do you think she's taken? Or do you think he, she doesn't even remember him? My heart beats with yearning when I see her sweet and lovely face. For you, oh my former beloved, my feelings resemble the deepest depths of the deep sea of dreams. But alas, I am still young. I want my heart aflame, burning brightly like the fires of Zarek. She... Oh, my former beloved, is the spark that shall kindle my desires. A bitter tear... Stop, 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 stop. First of all, we appear to have found the the fanfic district, but second of all... Have you noticed the guy immediately behind him who is repeatedly bowing to the guy on the shelf? What is going on there? Bitterly flowed down Bartikius' face. Look at him! As if slyly commenting on his endless, horrible suffering. If that is your wish, oh beloved. Hang on, hang on, I'm sorry. That's not actually fanfic. I'm sorry, that's the wrong word. Um, there's a term for this. It's cheap romance novels. And they're, they're this. And I, I don't mean cheap necessarily as a negative thing. Because it's, it's entirely deliberate. It's, it's trashy romance novels. I've heard that described by people who like them, to be clear. And the whole point is, is it pulp? Is that what they're called? Because the whole point is just, it's, it's just this. It's just like, oh, and then they're just totally ridiculous. And that's the idea, right? Bartekius vigorously ejaculated. Look, if you find more of these, please bring them to me as fast as you can. It might be possible to reconstruct them and that. I can't even begin to imagine what that would entail. Okay. If I find more pieces, I'll bring them to you. You have to. Nihal's hammer, I still can't believe it. It's okay, you get used to it. It's called being a PC. Yeah. It's a, yeah. That's better. Blasted, isn't it? What the old man is. Yes, the. The passion of the game, it inflames, engorges. I, I can't do purple prose like we were saying earlier. It engages my, my senses, a light upon blazing skies, burning blue fire into my soul, desirous of most fried chicken Kentucky. There you go. That's that's about as good as I got. Then they take on the Northander army in that village too. 
What was his name? Leonard? It's obvious they didn't give a fuck about the White Mist Treaty anymore. Ah, misinformation. The bane of human existence. Huh, I see. And just based on what I would normally call interface spoilers, it looks like I'm going to get at least two more groups recruited based on the layout of the base. I could be wrong, of course. By the way, I love this. Advanced main quest, 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 advanced main quest. But what I want to do is leave forever. Sick of this place. This place sucks. I don't even have any... I don't have a... I don't have a file on. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, von Falkenstein is probably a good person to ask about Spellforce 1 and 2, since I imagine he's played them. Sure. If he hasn't, then you may remove his other pinky. You have my permission. It's acceptable, you see, because... Though it is no fault, nor indeed guilt, of his own, his lack of knowledge in the matter, it still must be acknowledged. There is a, a mathematical judicial process, very legal and proper that must be followed in order to ensure the annotation of society leaves the mark it needs to upon our passing. In so doing, he will ensure his proper allocation of debt removal into the universe's bias against his own predisposed ignorance. Any questions? I do prefer it when people kill me for reasons that aren't personal, you know? It's it's all detached and you know business like. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. I'm afraid I must execute you. Oh yes, terribly sorry. Oh. Get ready. Do be quick about it, please. Of course, of course. I do have a 315 execution to make as well. Oh, of course, I understand completely. Do you mind if I have one last bit of tea before you execute me? Of course, of course. Here you go, sir. Hmm. That is a spotting good bit of tea. Thank you very much, sir. Of course, of course. Let's see. Now, if you'll excuse me. Stab. Ugh. Fair enough. Let's do this. No. Before I die. Yes, is there something else I can do for you? Do me a favor. Tell my tailor I'll be late for my appointment. All right, here goes nothing. Excuse me, sir. Uh, Bob will be late for his appointment. Why? Well, I just executed him out in the streets. Oh, do I dare say. Uh, will he be rescheduling? No, I don't think he'll be back. You will have to settle affairs with his wife, I'm, sure, I'm afraid. Oh, of course, of course. For the fire wielders! Very good. Carry on. Then you better talk. We want information on your syndicate. Yes, of course. What do you want to know? Preferably everything. Well, there I was. In my mother's fallopian tube. How did you end up like this? What? I'm going to see the outside again? Just how you promised. Yes. Just how I promised. Well, I must say that I'm happy you made that decision. I will go back to the guild now and prepare my things for our journey as discussed. I will see you there. Well, I probably just doomed this city to total destruction. I won't even find out probably until the ending. Alright, now that Mr. Red's gone, I can stop being dumb and terrible. Oh, thank God. Alright, let's let's talk about proper tax distribution. No, I'm not stupid. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Well, allow me to spoil everything for you, Mr. Red. So the next thing that happens is that... There's going to be fish for some reason. I'm not actually sure why. And the Tatarn Ishkians, they said, hey, we'd like to reward you with this ancient relic of our things. And honestly, I couldn't figure anything to do with it, so it's just been sort of uh, keeping my billfold in place. You know, That way I know if someone's pickpocketing me, because I put the artifact in it, so I'll feel the weight being removed if someone pickpockets me. You were using the ancient glass town of Tatarstoknik as a way to prevent pickpockets! Well, yeah. It was very useful at it. Would you, would you 
like it? Yes, give me the star with you blithering idiot! Oh, 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 God, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Mr. Stone. Yeah. Just for fun. In a minute. Just, just... You're gonna have to... Just, just hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Just give it a second. Oh, we're, we're almost... Almost... Almost there. Almost there. Yeah, we're there. Okay. Now yes, you... Corporal? Are you deaf? Stop it right now. This is an order. Shit. Here they come. Why is she this stupid? She is aggressively stupid. I think we're set. So it's... No, I certainly didn't expect your... Anyway, best we get started. I'll order a carriage of basic provisions to be delivered your way. She's leaving. She's started. leaving him to die. Craftsman with you, I suggest you share some of your resources with us. Gerald pops in. What the heck? Siri, you missed. Oh, sorry. Let me fix that, and then they just pop out. Is it? Is it? No. <clears throat> this. <laughs> this is wrong. He's gone. I'm sorry it had to come to this to harm. It was his choice. And he dropped a simplistic gray short sword. Wow. No, that, that, wow. That's the loot he dropped. Only the old father should have the power to shape life like that. And we should free this thing from its suffering. I doubt it is suffering. It only seems to be capable of very primitive emotions. We will not kill this thing. It's harmless. <sighs> All right. Then do as you wish. I mean, you're going to turn on me anyway, so you know, piss off, buddy. Whatever you find in there, remember that I only did what I deemed best for you. Please. I don't... Oh, follow. my God, Rohan. Smack! Never mind. Maybe you'll see. Maybe you won't. Now, go on in. Can someone hand me a newspaper already? I gotta, I gotta have a word with Mr. Guido, or not Mr. Guido, sorry, Mr. Rohan. No turning back now. So I am half shaper. How come it doesn't show? Once again, this has to do with the way we conceive, but I do not want to talk about it. I hope you understand. Listen, if you're not gonna talk to me about how you had sex, Mom, we're gonna have an issue here. I'm just saying. What happened then? No, this is insane. There has to be another way. No, Tahar. There is not. Well, okay. Um. So I have a bunch of artifact gear. And, uh, lots of auras. My health isn't even moving, Why dude. Do you resist? It's pointless. That book. Did it say anything about how this ritual worked? Andrew said something about how the shapers conceive differently. Okay, I was kind of joking earlier, but apparently we really do desperately want to know how our mother had sex. Yep. Walk up. So here's the deal. I can kill you quietly and peacefully, or we can fight. Um, the ladder's gonna be a lot messier. It's up to you. So, um, you know, your preference. I'm, I'm amiable. We, we can make whatever. We got this. Okay, you're drawing your weapons. That sounds like we're gonna fight. Okay. Okay. Oh, Alright. Wait, are you throwing a moon at me? Maybe. I figured it'd be quicker. Mm -hmm. 
Gore? Huh? Did you orcs ever consider moving into a friendlier climate? I mean, no offense, but this place is a wasteland. We need the struggle. The struggle prevents us from finishing dialogue. That's the whole point of it. You repent. You die. Yeah, that's pretty much us right now, Adam. One does not simply walk into more. Who are these guys? And we're just walking into the scene. Guys, we're back from Mordor. What? Yeah, yeah. Whew, it's, it's been a trip. My dogs are killing me. I'm with him. the Queen. Not with him, though. We here, the Lore Walkers, do not believe in war crimes. We think that for the best possible player choice outcome, we're going to start charging people for war crimes. Done. In any case, to ensure the best possible experience for every player when committing war crimes in our game. Yes. Look at the pile of bodies. <laughs> there might have been a battle around here. Can we can we get some fire? Deal with that. The output. We're being attacked. What? Snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? Your regret won't bring back the dead. He's dead, Tahar. Let's go back to Silverhand. Well, that was wonderful. That's exactly what I was picturing this day going out like. Hey, so two of the elven leaders just died for no reason. One of them deliberately started a plague to ensure people would restur return to their faith. The other one self-sacrificed, partially willingly, in order to stop the other one. You're welcome. Well, hopefully those defenses I set up are going to hold. I notice they're still in place. That's nice. Hey, here comes the enemy. Enjoy my massive army, which is sitting right at your front gate. Oh, he's, they're withdrawing. They're withdrawing the army. What are you doing? I left... Okay. Hmm. Oh no, I feel you, Mockingbirds. That's that's why I say this is a whole lot of... Bleh. It's it's not like... Oh, you have a cut on your arm. You know, it, it's not easy. Hmm. I, I was talking to my sister about that. Some decisions are easy. It's like, oh, well, yeah, duh. And then there's situations where it's like... And technically, there's a third category of situations where there is no good answer whatsoever. Those are the best kind. I am ready. We don't like to talk about those. We don't go to Rayfall anymore. Ugh. They will fall. But why do you expect this to be complicated? We have a common enemy, so joining forces is the only thing that makes sense, isn't it? Theoretically, yes. But let me explain. And then he just says the word politics, and that's the explanation. See, Tahar, the thing is, there's no way on EO we will ally ourselves with House Hallett. But his dislike for you is irrational. He knows you're not what he made you out to be, and essentially it boils down to the fact that he thinks you're not fit to lead an army. That you're weak. Just think about it. Why would he have us travel here if he weren't considering an alliance? So, in other words, Unless there's some bigger scheme to his play that he hasn't let me in on yet, our presence here means that he's considering an alliance with you. Hmm. So what do you suggest we do? You need to show him you're not the weakling he thinks you are. While my brother was in the camp brooding over old feuds. So, I haven't decided which one I want to pick yet. I kind of want to talk to the other one first, but that's why we just saved. Because it could be one of those, oh, you talk to the other camp, that means uh, I'd rather die than talk to you. Feud, 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 feud. Feud. Feud? I admit I'm not one to hold a grudge in general, so I'm not really one to talk here, but come on, guys. 
Abomination! What the... Treason? This is treason! You can't... Now! <laughs> Ulrich just betrayed us. Oh, that's great. To the purity. Don't harm my brother! What was that, your deal? I'll sell them out if you don't kill my bro. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. You are so dead. You are so dead. Like, we may not do a lot of DPS, but we are tanks. You see the amount of damage we're taking? I'll give you a hint. It's practically none. And now it's literally none. Like, every time you see my health bar pop up, that's me taking some damage. Every time you see the health bar go away, that's me healing back to full. I just, I just want to beat that clear for anybody not familiar with the interface. That's what's happening. Careful. A light bringer. You're pathetic to heart. Do you really think you can stop Hey, it's us? my face again. I'll never stop- oh, he's dead. I'll never stop him. What the? It, it just disappeared. Is it just me, or did that new trinket you're wearing just yes, glow? Yes, blah, 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 blah. Huh. Interesting. You must finish your conversation before moving on. Literally forcing me to listen to them be like, Oh my gosh, the thing we knew would remove the barrier, removed the barrier. Come on, game. And my mother. Soldiers, get ready. Lacan is hiding behind these doors. And once we dispel the barrier, I want you to charge in. We still don't know anything about that ritual he's preparing. But it might be- What dangerous. are they doing? So be on your guard. But whatever happens, there's one thing I know. Lacane will be put to justice. Many of us have given their lives for this fight, and all of us have bled for it. It was a war that no one wanted. And this is where it ends. <laughs> the troll's doing it too. Okay. Let's go. I'm sorry, Bertrand. Lacan needs to be put to justice. But maybe it's not yet too late for you. In that case, it is. I just wish you could see the world that I see to heart. I truly do. And I'm sorry. What the? Bertrand! No! Oh, <sighs> Such a pointless death. He's made his choice. There was nothing we could have said to convince him. Okay, as weird as this sounds, I like the fact that he was a low health nothing. I think we literally killed him in two swings. Is it really true that he needs me to complete the ritual? Yes. But first you need to get a high enough war score in order to be able to get the resources necessary to have access to the different endings. You know, maybe it should occur to you the fact that you are summoning spectral abominations. Maybe that should be a sign that you're not listening to, to Aenir? I'm just thinking outside the box here. Infidel! You'll burn for this! As you descend the dank stairway of Castle Waite, a memory flickers across your mind. Your father, standing over your cradle, eyeing you with a mixture of affection, indecision, and disgust. Almost like an archaeologist looking at a strange discovery. The memory disappears as soon as you and your companions reach the bottom of the stairs. Your father's sanctuary, as if touched by skeletal hands. A cold manifests on your shoulders. Slithering, creeping, crawling slowly towards your chest. I need an adult. So this is it. Intriguing.